into our Facebook page. One of the city's newest charter schools is now making its mark on student achievement. Yeah, and tonight's What's Cool in School report, our Sunrise Anchor Bruce Kopp shows us what has students eagerly headed to class on Saturdays and looking forward to their next adventure. I want you to take a look at the first two questions. Like most schools, students here at the Indiana Math and Science Academy West spend their weekdays in the classroom. Is it an hour of work? Yeah, absolutely. But every other week, dozens of students come back to class on Saturdays. Other students are off on school field trips to destinations like Chicago, St. Louis, and even the nation of Turkey. Their um, perspective on life has grown. It's not just my home, my small community. It is now um, the world. Student travel is just one program that the school's director says has led to overall academic achievement here. Our school has earned uh, exemplary rating in the last three years. The Math and Science Academy here on the west side opened five years ago. It's located in what used to be the old Toys R Us store. Twelve students will make up the first graduating class here this year. They'll be adding another 100 students in the next school year. What is the word early modifying? One of the standout programs is the Ivy League mentoring program. It pairs students with mentors and they meet every other Saturday. When I first heard that, I... I did think, well, that's my time to be out of school, you know, but I knew that it was going to help me and it was going to be very beneficial for my future. I think that even though they're coming to school on Saturday, it's a little bit more relaxed, but they know that it's beneficial for their future. They know that they're getting enriched and helping them to be successful. Students agree it has opened their eyes to achieving their dreams. Right now, I'd like to be um, a doctor. Beyond high school, I want to go to Ball State to study business. If I were to go to college, I would be the first person to graduate in my family, and that would just be amazing for me. There is a waiting list for students to attend here, where kindergartners are looking to read 5,000 books in 100 school days. Teachers say by summer, kindergartners will be reading at a second grade level. Bruce Kopp, Channel 13 Eyewitness News. Every week we take a close look at achievements and innovations in local education, and if you'd like Bruce to feature something that's cool at your school, be sure to